All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever uh, podcast. We don't we don't have a name yet. We're trying to figure out a name, um, but I, I have a couple ideas. Like, like that. Uh, cutting steak. Eating milk. <laughs> You're like really weird. The power move. I'm like an Asian teddy bear. <laughs> and then another thing is like, we never done a podcast before, so we're kind of just winging it. But we all have like different topics of like funny stories because we don't know what direction we, we really want to take this. But we all have a lot of stories. Like, okay, nominees for student of the year. And they like said my name and I was like, whoa, this is weird. And then they're like, okay, winner, Kyle Stafford. <laughs> and I was like. I don't, everyone's like, I don't know, and I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> Wait, did you walk up on stage and get like a, okay guys, this might be weird. Hear me out. Apparently there's a whole community of guys that wipe back to front. You, like you use my whole hand. Yeah, okay. Well. Do you heat it up at all? Like some people put it in the microwave for like 10 seconds to get it like mushy. I do that too. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, with your whole fist? <laughs> no, and that's just how I learned. It's like, like yeah. that's, I don't know. No, I'm, I'm curious how many weird things there are, like, in society that people think a majority of people do it a certain way, but actually they don't, but no one wants to admit it, you know? How cold is your freezer? <laughs> wait, what's your guys' favorite holiday, then? Probably my dad. Yeah, probably my dad. Well, okay, wait, I have a question, though. Does, does like, Christmas count as a holiday? Would you consider yeah. it a holiday? Yeah, but I wouldn't put it, like, I would say, like, the core holidays are, like, Thanksgiving, Labor or, Halloween, uh, <laughs> Labor Day, not Labor Day, Fourth of July, President's Day, <laughs> yeah, Fourth of July, like not Labor Day, Fourth of July, probably my dad, yeah, probably my dad. I mean, it's good. I, I like it. Okay, do you guys do you wipe after you poop? Yeah, I haven't done uh, it this year because I did it for the first time this year in like years, and it was very underwhelming. Yeah, I've, I haven't done it in a long the time. Process isn't fun. And then they start to mold yeah, and mush like down that. and get all deformed. And, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. we have this one teacher named Miss J. <laughs> and we have the funniest stories ever with her. So I just yep. wanted to tell a couple of them because they're great. So sometimes she would record the guys that wipe back to front. The power move. And this one day she was recording. So we knew she was being really serious. And like she always acted like a better teacher on those days. Yeah. And she was like, all right, guys, I need you guys to like wipe back to front. And I, I don't know why, but I thought it was so funny. And I just started crying. And we could, I think she had to, did she ask us to leave the room? She asked you to leave the room. I wasn't doing anything. Was, <laughs> Wait, really? Uh, all I said was like, oh, por qué? <laughs> I remember when she like personally left. Because she Dude, was, she broke tennis and started crying. crying. Remember when she kicked left? us out of the classroom? Yeah. Like, the whole class? Yes. Yeah. We were the in a whole entire class. We were, in a, class. we were in a portable and like she laid, were you in our class too? Yeah. yeah. We, we, she laid out all the like, like all those El Paso books or whatever. Yeah. For like as like a seating chart and then kids like moved them so they could sit by their friends. <laughs> and then she saw that people did that. And so she like walks in, she's like, I'm not gonna get a UTI. And then she's like, everyone get out of here. So we all were outside, it was raining. It was in a portable. So we we're just outside in the rain and we were out there for like 15 minutes while she was just like having a mental breakdown. <laughs> I remember like at the end of it, like, at the end of the year, once she was done with her masters too, she like broke down just because she was like, I'm, I'm so proud of you guys. Like you guys were so helpful and I've just been through so much. And like, she like broke down from our class and we we're just a bunch of awkward eighth graders. And it was just kind of like, who moved my box? I remember, um, she would wear a bunch of clothes from my dad, but like, <laughs> I, I thought it was really unusual, but I, now it was, we got 66% of us who do it here. <laughs> Every day. Dude, I, 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 like, I, I'm convinced she wore my dad. Whatever your style is. If it fits, it fits. Yeah, shoe fits I guess. Right. But, I mean, we're burning ants. Uh, we also have some good lunch stories, too. Okay, yeah. I also wanted to tell some of our lunch stories because... <laughs> okay, wait. First, before we do this, this is a story that's unrelated. Well, okay, it's related to lunch. But this is just a story I need to get off my chest. One time in sixth grade, something that really set me back in life. I was sitting at lunch just eating my food. I was in jail and I was just like, I, mean, I had farted and I thought it was gonna be just a fart and it wasn't a fart. <laughs> just some stuff came out. So I was like, I just ran inside, changed my boxes real quick and came back out. Warmth on the side of my head. I'm like, oh, well, this is what I am. I'm just awkward now. <laughs> Okay. Walked so away. did you like go to the bathroom and clean no. up? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was just sitting there. I was kind of like warmth. But anyways, uh, if that's it, drop a like, comment down below, subscribe if you guys are new. If we do end up doing this consistently, we'll start a channel for it. Let us know if you guys have a name for what we should call the podcast, too. Back of your nuts to the front. Wow. 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 All right, bye. <laughs> okay, bye. All right, what's up, guys? Hopefully, you all enjoyed this video, and hopefully, you found it as funny as we did when Kyle and Shim and I first watched this. We were just crying, laughing 
We thought it was absolutely hilarious. Uh, if you're not familiar with my channel or my podcast or anything, basically, I just got back into uploading to YouTube a couple weeks ago. Uh, I upload on this channel once or twice a week, every single week. And we started a podcast called Peak to Middle School that goes up every Monday and Thursday, uh, every single week. And we've been doing it for quite a few weeks now and it's, it's just absolutely hilarious. We talk about some really weird stuff in the podcast and so it makes for perfect content like this where you just edit it totally out of context and make a pretty funny like compilation video like this. So if you guys did enjoy this video, please leave a like and drop a comment down below telling us your favorite part and maybe what parts you would like to see from other episodes of the podcast in uh, future videos like this. So if you guys wanted to go over and check out the podcast, it would mean a lot. It's on all platforms. But uh, I also wanted to shout out the editor of this video, my buddy named Matt. Matt is a music producer and a rapper and he's honestly really, really good. He's still getting into it and trying to grow his brand and his name. So if you guys wanted to go check him out on SoundCloud or Spotify, that would mean a lot to him and to me. Uh, he's literally been one of my good friends for a long, long time and he's, he's really good. I'm not just saying that because he's my friend. If he was trash, I would tell you. Other than that, I will see you guys on Wednesday with a brand new video. Peace out.